as I said in the previous video. We just need to calculate follow sets if we have Epsom productions and we want to and we have to compare first and follow sets to check if a grammar is LL4 or LLK or LL whatever. But I will just um, calculate the follow sets for you so you know how it works. So I will calculate the follow set of lengths 4 from S or of S first uh, follow set of s, yes, and I don't like to write so much, so I will just write the first two letters, I will write the follow set of a for you, and I will calculate the follow set of length 4 from of b for you. And because in our grammar always s is always a start symbol, if not stated otherwise, um, there's also the end of the word in the follow set of S. Because if you have a span of the start symbol over the whole word, then you know that behind those start symbol there is only the end of the word and we write it as a dollar sign. And again, if we have a terminal string that's shorter than our look ahead, so this is just one symbol while we want a look ahead of four, well, it's just fine. If there are not more symbols to write, then we just write the symbols that we have. So, but S can also appear at the right hand side of the B rule and because it's um, the last symbol in the right hand side of the B rule that means that it will um, that um, well it will get all um, all elements of the follow set of B as well and we don't have them yet so we have to calculate them first. Well, let me just do a derivation. If we have, I will just make a derivation to make it clear. If you have a start symbol and we use this rule, and in the next step we can derive from the, well, I can just write the word end sign for you. So it, it's just, it's not part of a regular um, derivation, but just to make clear what the follow set will be. In the next step, well, here would be a dollar sign as well. Well, and in the next step, I could derive from the A, the terminal A, and I would get A, B, A, dollar. And here you see that in the follow set of B, there's indeed A and the end of the word. But we are not done with it, because well, we can derive... Um, well, we can derive uh, in the next step, we can exchange B by those right hand side. So I keep the A and then I write A, A, S, A, dollar. And I do another derivation step, I exchange S by A, B, A. So I keep the first three A's, and then I write A, B, A. And I just keep that A and the dollar sign. And you know, in when well, the next step, I would, I could uh, exchange the non-terminal A by a terminal A. And as you see in the follow set of B, there's also two A and the end of the word. And I. Well, well, I could just do it again and you would see that I will get more and more A's. So in the follow set of B, I will have three A's in the end of the word as well and four A's. And I don't need to write the end of the word sign because we just have a look ahead of four. And again, as I did for the first sets, I will just do... Um, all derivations until I have um, terminal strings up to my look ahead and then I would can just uh, copy the follow set from that. So um, I don't have any more to add and as I stated before because S appears at the right hand side of the of those B rules and S will get all members of the follow set of B as well so S will get all these elements in the follow set as well. So S will have 
a dollar and that's the same as you can see here here s is followed by a end of the word sign and if i would exchange those b by this then i would have s and two a's and the dollar sign or the word end and and there you see that s will indeed have the um, the same members as b has in the follow set so s will have a a dollar as well and three a's and the end of the word and also four a's and for more we just don't care and then you see that we have a and a appears at the right hand side of an of those two s rules and that means a will also get all um, all members of the follow set of S. So A will have the end of the word behind it, or A could have A and the end of the word sign, or uh, the end of the word sign behind it, or two A's, or three A's, or even. And I hope, um, well, then I am, I, I am done with calculating all follow sets of the links of four. And I hope that this might help you if you are in the situation that you have to calculate your own follow sets.